Welcome to another episode of Tech Talk Today, where we explore the latest and greatest in technology, from groundbreaking software to exciting innovations that shape our digital landscape. I'm your host, and today we're diving into a powerful new code editor that's making waves, LAPS. What makes LAPS so special? Well, it's crafted entirely in Rust, which already sets it apart with lightning-fast performance capabilities. I mean, who doesn't want a tool that responds instantly while coding? It actually incorporates something called rope science from the Xi editor. Now I know what you're thinking. What on earth is rope science? Let me break it down a bit. It's essentially a data structure that helps manage large amounts of text efficiently. This means that when you're working on a hefty project with lots of files and code snippets, LAPS won't slow you down. Doesn't that just sound amazing? And it doesn't stop there. LAPS comes fully equipped with built-in LSP support, which stands for Language Server Protocol. That's a fancy way of saying it offers smart coding features like code completion, diagnostics, and various code actions that can dramatically enhance your coding experience. Imagine typing out code and having the editor suggest improvements or detect errors in real time. It's like having a coding assistant right beside you. Oh, and for those of you who love the keyboard-centric approach of Vim, Lapsy has got you covered. It supports modal editing as a first-class citizen, allowing you to toggle between modes as you please. So, whether you're a veteran Vim user or just curious about this approach, you can dive in right away. One of the standout features is its built-in terminal, allowing users to execute commands without ever leaving the editor. This makes multitasking and keeping everything organized so much easier. You can pretty much do everything you need in one window. Now, if you're a remote developer, you'll be pleased to hear that Lapsy includes features inspired by VS Code remote development. This means you can enjoy the feel of local coding while harnessing the power of a remote server. How cool is that? And with LapDev, a cloud development environment service, it's even easier to set up and manage your remote projects. So how do you get started with LAPS? It's straightforward. You can find pre-built releases for Windows, Linux, and Mac OS. For the adventurous among you, there's the option to compile it from source or use a package manager. The development community is also very welcoming. You can find guidelines for contributing if you want to be part of shaping LAPS's future. For those who are eager to connect with other Lapsy users, the community is thriving on platforms like Discord and Reddit. And if you prefer decentralized communication, there's even a matrix space. Talk about options. Before we wrap up, let's touch on the licensing. Laps is released under the Apache License version 2.0, allowing you to contribute or use the code as long as you adhere to its conditions. That's a big thumbs up for open source enthusiasts out there. So to sum it up, whether you're looking for speed in coding, powerful features that enhance productivity, or community support, LAP seems to tick all the boxes. What do you think? Could this be the next big thing in code editors? Let me know your thoughts or experiences if you've tried it out. Thanks for tuning in to Tech Talk today. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, keep exploring the tech world.